Uh, so here we go, chapter 15. Author's note, stop flaming, okay? BT dubs, you suck from no one every Tim someone flams me, I'm gonna slit my wrists. Fangs to Raven for helping. By the way, you suck from no one every t from, hmm. from now on, maybe? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. By the way, you suck from now on every time someone flames. I'm, I'm going to self-harm. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right. Ebony, Ebony, shouted Draco <gasps> sadly. She spelt it right the first two times. Sorry. Yay, Tara. <laughs> okay, sorry. Yeah, no, uh, just... Ebony, Ebony, shouted Draco sadly. Excuse me. Ebony, Ebony, shouted Draco sadly. No, please come back. But I was too mad. Whatever. Now you can go and... <laughs> Have sex with vampire, I shouted. I stormed into my room and closed my black door with my blood red key. Okay. It had a picture of Marilyn Manson on it. He looked so sexy in a way that reminded me of Draco and vampire. Okay. I started to cry and weep. Oh, I took a razor and started to slip my wrists. At least she spelled wrists right. Wait. Yeah. I drank the blood all depressed. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As a vampire, you cannot drink your own blood. I feel like that's rule number one. Probably. Like, isn't it, like, against, not the law, but, like... <laughs> well, I mean... It's against what they stand for. Also, yes. uh, do you even have blood as a vampire? I don't think so. Like, you drink it, but is it yeah, in you? I don't know. Buffy the Vampire Slayer would beg to differ. I would also beg to differ, really. Because, like, you're technically the undead, so you shouldn't have any blood. No, 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 you have blood in Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah, they bleed. Okay. But I'm like, well, I mean, maybe, like, it circulates through you because it, like, retains as you eat it. Mm-hmm. I don't know the science behind vampires. I, yeah. I really can't. I, I don't Why know. It asking? just sounds stupid. Like. <laughs> then I looked at my black GC watch. Good try. Good try. Uh, yeah. Watch. All right. And noticed it was time to go to biology class that they totally have at Hogwarts. What? They don't have biology. Maybe she meant Herbology. Herbology? All right, gonna go uh, deal with some mandrakes. I put on a short, ripped, black, gothic dress that said anarchy on the front in blood-red letters and was all ripped with and a spiky belt. Under that, I put on ripped black fishnets and boots that said Joel all over them with blood-red letters. I put my ebony black hair out. Just pulled her right up. out. I think she means up. All right. I hope. I hope so, too. Anyway, I went downstairs feeling all sad and depressed as usual. I did some advanced biology work. I was turning a bloody pentagram into a black guitar. Suddenly the, gu the guitar turned to Draco. So what she meant was... Turned into Draco. Uh, yes. Wait, wait, wait. I, biology? You don't Transfiguration? Turn... I guess. This How is, is that Biology? This is kind of getting boring. Like, I get it. You're annoyed. But, like, yeah. shut the fuck up. Like, shut the fuck up. We have like, so many more chapters. Oh, God. I know. Uh, Enabi, I love you, he shouted sadly. I do not care what those effer preps and posers think. You're the most beautiful girl in the world. Before I met you, I used to want to commit suicide all the time. Oh, my God. Now I just want to effing be with you. I effing love you. This is so point white. Period. So like, what? White. I, this is such a white person thing. We're like, both white. I know, but like I'm saying, like as a white person, yeah. this is what people would have identified with probably ten years ago. Yeah. Like, this is like the basis of what was white and emo <laughs> in 2006. Amazing. And it's making me very... Uncomfortable because I had identified with this at some point. Yeah. But it is getting so boring. It is. Chapter 15. Like, we were going somewhere and now we're not. And everyone just freaking loves her and I'm sick of it. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Then, dot dot dot, he started to sing The Chronicles of Life and Death. We considered it our song now because we fell in love when Joel was singing it right in front of the entire class. His singing voice was so amazing and gothic and sexy with two X's, like a cross between Gerard, Joel, Chester, Pierre, and Marilyn Manson. Author's note, don't you think those guys are so hot? If you do not know who they are, get the F out of here. 
OMFG, I said after he was finished. Some effing pref stared at us, but I just stuck up my middle fingers. They were covered in black nail polish and were intertwined with Draco's now at them. I love you, I said, and then we started to kiss just like Hilary Duff. I effing hate dat bitch. And CMM, Chad Michael Murray, in a Cinderella story. Wait, so you're telling me she's emo, but she's seen a Cinderella story. <laughs> because I don't put those two together in the Not same category. However, that is romantic. Yup. Freaking great movie. Yup. Chad Michael Murray. I wish life was just that easy. Like, if I could get up on a table and just sing a really emo song to somebody and have everything <laughs> be fixed, <laughs> life would just be great. Like, i do it probably a lot more often than yeah. I already do. <laughs> that insinuates that I already do, and that's not true. I didn't mean that. Beautiful. Oh, I, I, I'm i not going to believe that. I believe that you do already do that. Okay, that's okay. fine. Maybe someday. <laughs> then we went away holding hands. Lupin shouted at us, but he stopped because everyone was clapping by how sexy we looked together. Then I saw a poster saying that MCR would have a concert in Hogsmeade right then. We looked at each other all shocked, and then went. Then we went together. How amazing. <laughs> that all of this just coincidentally lined up. It could end right here. But it doesn't. Here's chapter 60. Christ. <laughs> it's a fanfic that never <laughs> Oh, no. Chapter 60 is so long. long. Oh. We could do it. All right. Author's yeah. note. You know what? Set up, okay? Prove to me your nut preps. Raven, you suck, you effing bitch. Give <gasps> me back my effing sweetie. Sweater. Okay. The sweater from a couple chapters ago. Oh, yeah. You're supposed to write this. Uh, Raven, WTF, you bix. Uh, you're <laughs> si- <laughs> it <Bix>. doesn't. <laughs> it says you bitch, But I'm referring to B-I-T-C-H. Bix. Uh, you're supposed to do this. B2-dubs, fangs to Brittany5655 for Tekken my Japanese. Oh, no. <gasps> they speak Jack- Japanese. Oh my they god, super Japanese? kawaii. Oh my god, are they weeaboos? Yeah. Oh my god, wait, are we gonna enter a new territory? This might actually be better than I thought. Okay. <laughs> it's getting exciting again. Yes. Um, also, I like how, you know, we have the story of my immortal, but we're also getting a full story <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> from Tara and Raven, and now Brittany5655. What? I can't believe that bitch Raven stole her sweater. That's so <laughs> low. That's such a shady thing to do. Oh, jeez. Oh my All god, right. this is so funny. I hope Raven's okay. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> After getting fucking wrecked on. I feel like Raven's gonna end up, like, missing or dead by the end of this. Oh my god. Like, sorry, I told you, Raven. <gasps> oh my god, I hope so. I need to know what happens in Tara's life. Tara's, Tara's fictional life. I'm ready. All right, I'm okay. ready too. We ran happily to Hogsmeade. <laughs> how do you? Okay, first of all, how do you do that? <laughs> I need a visual. Uh, Is it a prance? Uh, yeah, frolicking, okay. frolicking oh, okay. as if through a meadow, but without the meadow. So just frolicking. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. You know, like the skip that they do in Wizard of Oz. Yeah. That. Aww, it's kind of <laughs> cute. <laughs> I need some water. I'm screaming too much. No, it's okay. All right. Oh my gosh, I'm so ready. Okay, sorry. I just ran happily. That's an interesting pair of words. Anyway. There we saw the stage where GC had played. We ran in happily. MCR were there playing Helena. Helena or Helena? Helena. Helena? Yeah, that's good. Okay. I also I always pronounce it Helena, but then I heard someone say Helena, and I was like, (gasps) am I wrong? It's Helena. Doesn't he say Helena in the song? I'm almost positive. I don't listen to MCR. I just exposed myself. (laughs) Like, I just now. You will enjoy the playlist. I'm so embarrassed. It's I okay. I just exposed my emo uh, past that it's okay. hard. Okay, anyway. It's okay. We've discussed this. I was the horse girl. And I was gothic. It was fun. You were so gothic. Um, I was so effing happy. Gerard looked even sexier than he did into pictures. Even Draco thought so. I could totally see him getting an erection, but it didn't matter because I knew now that we were the only true ones for each other. I'm so uncomfortable. I was wearing a black leather mini dress and black... You... Did you change as you were running happily to Hogsmeade? I, maybe they, like, changed before the running. Maybe right. there was a period of time that we were not informed oh, about. Oh, Tara. You scared me. This is the true scary chapter. This is, this is the real frightening part. 
<laughs> I was wearing a black leather mini dress and black leather platinum boots with red ripped fishnets. Draco was wearing a black baggy MCR t-shirt and black baggy pants. Anyway, we started moshing to Helena. We Frenched. We ran up to the front of the band to stage dive. Suddenly, Gerard pulled off his mask. So did the others. We gasped. It wasn't them at all. It was dot, comma, dot, 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 <laughs> Valsamort and the Death Dealers. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a band name. Oh my god, I hope if I ever, like, sold drugs, yeah. people would call us, like, Baltimore and the Death Dealers. Balsamort. Balsamort, sorry, yeah. the Death Dealers. Oh my gosh. That is it's so happy. So funny. Holy shit. Oh, Balsamore. That... No, my, my favorite uh, variation of Baltimore is still Baltimore. <laughs> Baltimore. <laughs> Oh my god. This Solely is, Vault and Proof from now This is on. wild, though. I like this twist. Yes. WTF, Draco, I'm not going to a concert with you, I shouted angrily. What? Not after what happened to me last time? Even if it's MCR you, and you know how much I lick them. But you were so happy. Ebony, what's going Wait, on? Wait, what just happened? Did I don't like, know. Is this like a flashback? No, I think it's just happening. Um... I... I, let's find out. Okay. Uh, you know how much you like them? What? Because we, you know, he gadgeted uncomfort, uncomfortably because guys don't like to talk about you know what. What? What? He's referring to the time they had sex after the... the guys don't like to talk about sex? Guys only like to talk about sex, in my experience. Stereotypes. No, I'm just well, kidding. Um, maybe they're making fun of that stereotype as well. Alright. Yeah, cause, uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, cause we, you know, I yielded in an angry voice. Why does she keep yielding? I don't know. Alright. She's a very hesitant bitch. <laughs> I can't. I can't. We won't do that again, Draco promised. This time, we're going with an ESCORT! All caps. ESCORT! Like a hoe? Like like a whore? Like a paid whore? <laughs> like is that kind of a escort? sex worker? Possibly. Um, or is it Dumbledore? <laughs> uh, it could be. It could be a chaperone. It could be a, a sex worker. We'll never know until we continue. Until we continue. Yeah. All right, escort. Um, OMFG, WTF forward slash. Are you giving into the mainstream, I asked? So I guess you're a prep or a Christina or what now? Does she what mean does Chris that mean? I think she means Christian. Oh, okay. I'm yeah. almost positive that's what that means. Christina. Hi, yes. Are I'm you a Christina, Christina Aguilera? <laughs> I am. Hi. No, he muttered loudly. Are you becoming a prep or what? I shooted angrily. <laughs> Shouted. Enneby, I'm not. Please come with me. He fell down to his knees and started singing The World is Black by GC to me. I was flattened because it's not even a single. He had memorized the lurks just for me. Oh my god. <laughs> First of all, yeah. I think it's hilarious. It's just like, it's not even a single. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh. Like, bitch, I know everyone direction <laughs> up and back to front, but that was not because I was trying to impress anybody. Like, oh boy. That is so funny. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> he had memorized the lurks just for me. Okay, then I guess I will have to, I said, and then we Frenched for a while, and I went up to my room. Where are they? Back at... Oh, I think this is the space of time that we missed before the concert. Oh. I think she's doing a flashback. All right. Bloody Mary was standing there. Hi, she memishai tea, girl, she said happily. She specs Japanese, so do I. Dat men's, how do you do in Japanese? I'm going to butcher this Japanese if it's even correct. <sighs> Well, according to Brittany 5655, it is very correct. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Brittany. Beachy Dubs, Willow, that effing poser. She's back! Willow's back! <gasps> Yay! Oh! Beachy Dubs, Willow, that effing poser got expelled. Oh, no, maybe she's not. not. <laughs> <laughs> she failed all her classes, spelled with a K, and she skipped math. Author's note Raven, you effing suck. F you. <gasps> oh my god! I didn't even know. <laughs> You were gone uh, for so long, you stole your sweater, now you're expelled. Damn it, I feel like Raven's been written out of the story, I mean, even though she wasn't really there to begin yeah. with, but still. 
It serves that effing bitch right. I laughed. I, oh, excuse me. How do you laugh angrily? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, it serves that effing bitch right. I laughed angrily. Well, anyway, we were, f we were felling all depressed. We watched some gothic movies like Death's Nightmare Before Xmas. <gasps> That's not. Oh my god, me. I love, okay. Girl, no, me too. Call me gothic, but like, yeah. I love. Call me gothic, but. I love Tim Burton movies and Nightmare Before me Christmas too. is so not emo, but I mean, okay. <laughs> Maybe Willow will die too, I said. I... Who hurt her? Like Raven. Okay, but like, <laughs> why would you hurt Raven like this? I don't know. Kawhi, Bloody Mare, shook her head energetically, lethargically. Lethar lethargically? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, have a confession. After she got expelled, I murdered her, and then Lupin did it with her because he's a necrophilic. Necrophilia? Yup. This is so bad. I... I'm getting lost. Also, you can't just say Kawhi <laughs> as, like, a... A... I don't know, explan... Ex yeah. Exclamation? I... That... And they spelled it wrong, first of all. Yeah. Second of all, it just means long? cute. It just means cute in Japanese. I murdered this girl. Oh, cute. Kawhi. <laughs> Death Kawhi. Like, no, what? Yeah. So, uh, Lupin's a necrophilia. Gross. And a pedophile, apparently. A pedophilic necrophilia. If anyone wants to... Actually, never mind. I'm not going to say that. Okay, if you really... Okay, I'm going to say it because it's, like, really fucked up. There's this movie called A Serbian Film, and okay. it's known throughout the horror community as the most disturbing movie ever created. Great. And it's literally about a guy who gets, like, conned into the porn industry in, like, Serbia, and it does all this really gross stuff with, like, dead bodies and, like, children and shit like that, and he's, like, forced to do it at some point, and the ending is really bad, and if you can't find it online or you don't want to watch shit like that, because it's honestly really fucked up, because it was, it's, it's banned in a couple countries as well, um, but if you don't want to just read the Wikipedia page, like, just read the summary, it's really, like, gross, it's I'm disgusting. Scared. It is, it's scary, it just, it reminded me of that for some reason, because, like, it's really... It's gross, so go read that. I don't suggest watching it, because I've never seen it, but I know I would literally vomit if I watched it, so yeah. like, read the Wikipedia summary. All right. We can do it. Great. If you want. Can't it wait. It's a different thing, but... Uh, yeah, okay, so he's a necrophiliac. Sorry. Uh, Kawhi, I commented happily. All right. Uh, we talked to each other in silence for the rest of the movie. How does that work? With your eyebrows. Mmm. <laughs> like... Oh, hey, BT Dubs, I'm going to a concert with Draco tonight in Hogs. Me with MCR, I said. It is a flashback. Okay. I need to wear, like, the hot set outfit ever. Bloody Mary nodded energetically. I said it like that. Yeah, because it's not <laughs> like that. Yeah. <laughs> it's, like, half capitalized, but then in the middle, not, and then one L is not. Of the three. Of the three. OMFG, totally, let's go shopping. In Hot Topic, right, I asked, already getting out my special Hot Topic loyalty card. Oh my god, no joke, I had one. I also did. Oh my god! Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it so cute. So and cute. sad. Um, yeah. those, I, well, I regret it. I do. I, mm. well, my mom, like, still gets me stuff from Hot Topic because they've got some nice socks. And I collect, like, little pins, so she'll get me something new. Oh. Yeah, it's like, I, I only need it for, like, the fandom stuff. Yeah, no, I go whenever there's, like, a really cool movie out that they start sponsoring, because, yes. like, sometimes the merch is cool. Like, for, um, when they did Suicide Squad, before mm -hmm. I knew how bad the movie was gonna be, <laughs> I was like, Harley Quinn shit forever! And then I was like, why? Well, I never, I didn't buy anything, but I was like, <sighs> I give into capitalism so easily. <laughs> That's all Hot Topic is. Yeah. Well. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Um, uh, in the yeah, Hot Topic loyalty card, no, my head snap, snaped up, snaped up, uh, what, my head spooing, I could not believe it, bloody Mary, are you a prep, no, no, she laughed, ha ha ha, I found some cool gothic stores near Hogwarts, that's all, okay, you could have said that sooner, bloody Mary, 
Who told you about them? I asked, sure it would be Draco or Diabolo or Vampire. Don't even say that, Nam, to me. Or me. Dumbledore, she said. Let me just call our Brahms. O-M-F-F-G, Dumbledore, I asked, quietly, even though it's on all caps. Yeah, I saw the map for Hogsmeade on his desk, she told me. Come on, let's go. We were going in a few punk goth stores, especially for the concerts in Hogsmeade. The salesperson was OMG hotter than Gerard, except not because that's impossible, and he gave me a few dresses. We only have these for Dereal goths. Dereal goths? Me and Bloody Mary asked. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how many posers there are in this town, man. Is he a hippie? I mean, I talk he like that, is now. but also... I mean, me too, but, like, I'm reading it like that. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how many posers there are in this town, man. Oh my god, that's yeah. totally what I read in my mind. Beautiful! You, like, read it. Yesterday, so Lupin and Snap tried to buy a gothic camera pouch. He shook his head. I didn't even know they had a camera. OMFG, now they're gonna spy on me again, I cried, running out of the changing room wearing a long black dress with lots of red tulle coming out and very low cut with a huge slit. Oh my Satan, you have to buy that outfit, the salesperson said. <laughs> yeah, it looks totally hot, said Bloody Mary. You know what, I am gonna give it to you free- oh, excuse me. You know what, I'm gonna give it to you free because you look really hot in that outfit. Hey, are you going to be at the concert tonight, he asked. Yeah, I am, actually. I looked back at him. Hey, BT Dubs, my name's Abondi Darkness Dementia Tara. What way, what's yours? Oh, my God. <laughs> so, obviously, it's Tara. Yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, Tom Ridd. <gasps> That's his name? Yeah. Oh, my God. Poser. No, I'm just kidding. No, do you... Do you get it? Yeah. Tom Riddle? Yeah. Alright, cool. I was just saying, like, he's a poser. Oh, yeah. Alright. I'm sorry. For not no, it's okay. You. He said and ran a hand through his black dyed hair. Maybe I'll see you there tonight. Yeah, I don't think so, because I'm going there with my BF Draco, you sick perv, I yelled angrily. But before he could beg me to go with him, Hargrid flew in on his black broom, looking worried. OMFG and Bondi, you need us to get back into the castle now. And that's chapter 16. Oh my god. Yep. I don't even know what's happening anymore. I, so I it was it was funny and then it wasn't. Yep. And now it's I'm kind just of like weird now. Yeah, now we're just getting into strange territory. <sighs> There's so much more to go. I know. Mm. All right. Well, Subscribe if you want to see more videos or podcasts like this. Hit the bell for notifications if you want to be notified when I upload. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Legends of Mia. And in the comments section, um, did you have a Hot Topic loyalty card? Let us know. Just the point cards.